Hey everybody, I'm Mark, and today on Make Your Mark, we are celebrating my favorite holiday, hands down, which is Valentine's Day. Now, I love making Valentines, I love sending Valentines, but mostly, I love getting Valentines. Well, today on Make Your Mark, we are making love tokens, and these can be used as a pendant for a necklace, a pin, or you can just pop it in an envelope and send it to someone you love. And we're putting them all together with my Sherbonder glue gun and Sherbonder glue sticks. Thumbs up if you like this video, and leave me a comment if you have a question about this project, or you just want to say Happy Valentine's Day. Are you ready? Let's make some love tokens. The first romance was probably Samuel Richardson's Pamela, which was published in 1740. The Pamela of the title is Pamela Andrews, a 15-year-old servant who has to deal with the unwanted advances of her employer. Things never change. Before the 17th century, the first love tokens were coins that had been bent twice so they could no longer be used as money. They were given as amulets and charms to prospective lovers. While love tokens can be found all over the world, they reached the height of popularity in the U.S. and Great Britain in the late 1800s, at a time when the populations of both countries were eager to embrace sentimentality. I'm going to leave a link to Sherbonder and everything I used for this project in the description below. Thumbs up if you like this video, leave me a comment and I will get back to you. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and press the notification bell so that you know I have a new video. Grab any one of my craft books for inspiration. I think you'll like the Big Ass Book of Crafts Volume 2 and I'll see you next week. Happy Valentine's Day!